We told you Nico Sturm is not going to play tonight. We'll also circle back to Redeem Shimek. He is out too. These are two hits suffered to Sharks players up in the head, Hanner, in the last couple games. And we'll just replay what happened to Shimek here in this game against Minnesota back on that road trip. So in both of these, we didn't like the hits. This one was not even a penalty, but this one was not a suspension or a fine. And the hit on Sturm last game, there was a penalty, but that's it. And this is where I have a real problem with it, with the player personnel and the player safety. Right. Is that to me is an east-west hit the chicken where wing. he does the chicken wing. Yeah. And, and that's where you can get serious injuries. And obviously Shimmick did it with the games he's missed. And then you see the hit here from Nico Sturm. Now this is something again, east-west Carpenter understands he's in a vulnerable position. Yes, maybe he didn't see the hit coming, but you as a player, I think the onus has to be on the player to maybe lay off off that hit a little bit you never like to see guys get hurt and, and in those two instances those are key guys for us as a team you know I go back to that Shimmick one which I think in some ways was a little bit worse yeah. where you sit there and that chicken wing and Pops you can con con you. concussions yeah. for that you see is the head was the principal point of contact maybe with the Nico Sturm I'm not so sure about suspension, but at least a fine. Something to tell that guy that that's not the hits you want to be taking because basically a two-minute penalty, you know, there's not much repercussion on that, and that's something where you're, you're going to lose a key player for the Sharks here for who knows how long. Well, let's go back to the other night. Sturm absorbs that hit. He goes straight into the dressing room, gets evaluated, gets checked out, comes back into the game. And I don't think the NHL will ever admit this, but there's something about a player returning to the game where maybe any kind of discipline is forgotten about you know and now look at he played the rest of that game but something is not right with him tonight where he cannot go tonight I've obviously got to think it's the head issue and just not he knowing himself he's not ready to go that frustrates me that maybe discipline wasn't taken because of what he did the rest of the other night yeah I, I mean agree I, I had a situation like that happen in my last year where there was a, a chicken wing against Daniel Cleary and I ended up going out and fighting him right away but then a few days later my concussion sets in I'm kind of out for a couple days right but you know I don't like the way the NHL does that to me a hit to the head and if if you're, they talked about east-west hits, how long a guy's out is determined upon the suspension. Right. Where they, to be able to get guys to really commit to not taking those type of hits, right. I think you make any contact with the head there where you lunge out to make contact there, that should be a suspension, a fine, something to let those guys know they can't do that. There's too much back and forth. Guys, players, that's what frustrates us most. We'd be in the locker room and you never know, right. is that a suspension, is it not? Some guys thought it was. You just never had an idea. We were doing the last two post-game shows saying, well, you know, didn't really affect tonight's game, but those two players will be disciplined. That was the impression. And nothing, and I'll say this, it's one thing if you don't discipline them, uh, suspension or fine, it's another thing when the NHL doesn't come out with the reasoning why there was no discipline or suspension. I'd like to see George Peros in the old Brendan Shanahan videos come out and say, here's the controversial play, we'll show you what we saw, and we'll also tell you here why they did not discipline. Because it makes it look like that's an okay play. The other one on Shimmick wasn't even penalized. Yeah. So are you coming out and saying that that is perfectly okay in this game? Yeah. I, to me, no. And I, to a lot of players, I know that that's not the way it is.